That masked man. Oh yeah, brothers, it just it doesn't do it. Let's do it. The best in the world has returned. Listen to it, turn it up. Oh my god. Great entrance theme. Oh. Always, always, people. All right, brothers and sisters, it is me, Hollywood Edwards. You're on YouTube. And you're listening to the Soldiers of Shoot channel. Guys, he's back. He's back. The best in the world is back. If you don't know the story, I'll fill you in, but you are a wrestling fan because you're listening to me talk on a wrestling channel on YouTube and you're going to hear wrestling talk. So I assume you know, but in case you don't know, there's a little indie fed out there in Wisconsin called MKE. I guess Silas Young was booking the show or runs the show or whatever, helping out or I don't know if he's an owner or what, what the deal is, but he was booking. 350 people in a Knights of Columbus building and a masked CM Punk hits the ring, delivers the GTS to someone, exits the ring. It was over just as quickly as it began. And how do we know this was CM Punk? Well... Someone put out a picture of Instagram with Punk the same day, and he's wearing the same clothes. Now, people out there could be thinking, well, how do we know it's it? What do you mean, same clothes? What, black t-shirt? No. No. Violent Gentleman's Hockey Club hoodie he had on in both pictures. Same pants. The only difference was he had a mask on and gloves probably to cover his hand tattoos. Just to cause speculation. And boy, we are going to speculate right here on the channel. My guy. My guy. CM Punk. Will he be back? Is this going to be a recurring thing? Let's break it down. First, heard an interview with Silas Young, and apparently Punk cut his teeth. One of the companies where he cut his teeth was MKE. Now, he, Silas Young, in an interview said that this building is getting torn down. Could Punk have just been there and wanted to hit it one last time? I don't know. I don't know what his history is with the building, but he does have a history with the company. Okay? That's out of the way. If he wanted to do it just for funsies, let's say that's the case. He did it for funsies, and he went out, hit it, boom, done. What if? What if he wants more? That's my question. Second part to this is, what if he didn't do it for funsies? What if this is a huge scheme, a huge work, and we're going to see more of it? What if it builds to something? What if all the BS reports, Matt Jackson, oh, I text CM Punk, but he won't come back. I just, I can't get him. Oh, he won't, he won't come back. What if that's BS? What if the grand plan in this? I don't know. Weekend's coming up. What's going on this weekend? Impact has a pay-per-view, right? NWA Crockett Cup on pay-per-view. A Com couple companies involved in that one, right? Four, NWA, ROH, CMLL, and uh, New Japan. So that's basically like everybody right there. Um, and maybe maybe he'll just hit another indie. Maybe maybe he'll step the game up. Maybe he'll hit a 500-seater. I don't know. What if we see the masked man again this weekend somewhere? Then the speculation is really going to begin. Because we know. 
And let me just speculate. Let me just go where everybody wants this to go. Where everybody wants this to go is to AEW. So let's talk. Is it a possibility? If he has the bug again, I don't care if you hate CM Punk or just think he's a he's a jobber MMA fighter. Ooh, oh, you, you went to UFC and got his ass kicked. Well, who's the dummy? Okay, he went and made a fortune in fake fighting, and then he decided, I was so good at that, I'm gonna go try the real fighting. So he does, and oh by the way, money talks, bullshit runs the marathon. You figure it out. He goes, gets that mad money from the UFC. Fights twice and loses like he gives a shit. What's next? Maybe I'll go back. Has it been long enough? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe he's got the bug again. Maybe he didn't have the bug until he hit the ring. Maybe he got the the butterflies in the stomach right before he went out and hit the ring. Maybe he got them. Maybe he got the adrenaline rush when he left the ring. Maybe just maybe. We've seen... On being the elite, we've seen the Bucks show up at indie shows from the East Coast to the West Coast and everywhere in between, right? We, we've seen that. We know they've been doing that. What if Punk himself is going to build this masked man run-in gimmick, get everybody talking, and what if, let me paint the picture. Oh, let me paint the picture. Double or nothing. Chris Jericho, Kenny Omega. You figure out the ending. Go ahead. You book your ending. The masked man hits the ring for the sixth time on an indie show. And he hits Kenny Omega, takes him out, and takes the mask off. And there he is standing in the middle of the AEW ring. Double or nothing. Could it happen? Down in the comments, please. Would you like to see it happen? Down in the comments. One thing we know about the Bucks and Omega and Cody, they love to work, don't they? They love it. They love, love, love it. They love the surprise and the shock. And and that's one of the reasons why all of us here at SOS are so excited for AEW. We just saw the hype with the double or nothing. Cody's opponent... Weekly, Cody's putting these tease, tease, tease. Who's it going to be? Turns out it's Dustin Rhodes. We'll talk about that on a separate video. I actually said on this channel way back three months ago that I would love to see that if it was a possibility. Turns out it is, and I do. I I am so excited to see that. It's going to be really cool. But could it be possible that we are all being worked? Nick and Matt... Yeah, no punk, no punk. Punk's not interested. This, that, the other thing. Go ahead, search CM Punk on YouTube. You'll see all that bullshit out there. Is that what it is? Is it bullshit? Is he really signing up? Is he really coming back? Does he really have the bug again? Did Cody Rhodes and Tony Khan make him an offer that he can't refuse? Money talks. Bullshit runs the marathon. CM Punk. Maybe coming soon to a TV near you i'm hollywood edwards soldiers of shoot down in the comments i really want to know opinions everybody you want to see cm punk back if you do put it down there tell me where you want to see him me easy aew what about you leave me a message down in the comments guys appreciate it hit the bell hit the subscribe button and i'll see you next time but i'll ride you out one more time this fire burns best in the world is back